We would like to see more services delivered to people of the Shoalhaven so that families who are in desperate need to, of medical assistance don't have to travel to Wollongong. We would like to have more money spent on rehabilitation, drug and alcohol counselling and in that way servicing our communities better. The Greens in Shoalhaven would like to see more resources directed to mental health. Climate change is very real and how we can manage that in the Shoalhaven is to push now for immediate uh, changeover to sustainable power. The Greens will be the only party that makes sustainable power happen now so renewable sources such as solar and wind will be the forefront of our fight in reducing CO2 emissions. The Shoalhaven has an opportunity now to focus on an industry that is jobs rich, so jobs that will be there for a long time to come as we make an impact in CO2 emissions for now and for the future. On climate change, the Greens are the strongest party. We've been at this issue for so many years. It's only now in the recent months that the, the major parties have decided that they'd like to catch up. That gives us an excellent platform, a positive platform, to leap into our future right now and not be waiting for alternative technologies when we already have proven technologies such as wind and solar energy. We need to really take control of our water resources and have strong policy that will guide us into the future. Having it in a micro level so that each town is more in touch with what they have to do instead of relying on a bigger system, we'll get a fairer outcome for all of the users and be more sustainable for our communities in the long run. A fair go for all workers is what the Australian Greens are all about. We are already fighting within the state system to make sure that our teachers are not left behind and put into the downward spiral that Howard's Work Choices Bill has brought upon us. Looking at innovative ways of treating petty crime will reduce the amount of people that are in our jails, reduce the burden on our society 